I call it the Dope Show STL because I'm showing a body of work that I've been making since, you know, 2014, 2015. But then I'm also giving a retrospective view of a bunch of things that people from St. Louis have never seen. You know, it's contemporary stuff that I do right now. It's things from the 90s. And matter of fact, I even have a piece that I did in kindergarten. That's the only piece in this exhibit that's not for sale. The relationship that I have from St. Louis is a great one in so many different ways. I mean, one, I was born here. Uh, two, I went to the greatest high school of all time, Hazelwood East. But bigger than that, I mean, all of my mentors, like everybody that helped shape me as an artist and even as a man, like they're all located in St. Louis. The best way that I can describe this collection is that I think that you really get an insight view of like how my brain functions, you know. Usually when an idea comes to me, like it splinters and it just goes off to a bunch of different ways and solutions at the same time. That has led me to work in a lot of mixed medium formats. It also lets me combine like all of my disciplines, you know, like I went to Washington University, got a degree in painting, but I've also worked in fashion. I've also done product development, advertising. You know, the impact that I've been able to make in pop culture is something that I definitely don't take for granted. With a lot of the uh, music projects that I've worked on over the years, you know, like at that time when I was actually creating them and designing them and doing art direction, like I never really considered the impact that they would have. I'm very proud of the fact that from a design standpoint, like they still hold up. And when I meet people and they discover that I did it, like their eyes light up. I'm extremely proud to work with the Kranzberg Arts Foundation. We actually started this conversation in 2019, but you know, with the pandemic and things like that. And so like when I got the email saying that they wanted to re-engage back in March, I was extremely excited. I think what Kranzberg does for the community of St. Louis is incredible. And I'm looking forward to, you know, extending our relationship and working with them in the future. Yeah, so if you want to keep up with me and follow, you know, like what I'm doing and, and the next dope thing that I'm, you know, taking a part of, you can follow me on all social media formats at DL Warfield. And my website is dlwarfield.com and goldfingercreative.com.